Generic greetings and welcome back once again to Honey I Joined a Cult. Today's beverage is an almost non-existent green tea that's also lukewarm. Bad planning on my part to start this episode off with. Either way, in the previous episode, we were once again cracking on in our compound and indeed around the map as well. And because of several factors, we had some protesters. So they turned up around the compound and outside and were shouting all manner of complaints and uh, down with the sort of thing, careful now, quotes, etc. And that's not something we really want to see repeated. So we're going to try and reduce our heat a little bit. It's only on 181 of a thousand if it gets to a thousand i assume we get shut down but either way yeah not too bad at all in this episode more building more cracking on more cults so let's go ahead and do a bit of bookkeeping here this is uh, a couple of things i've been wanting to do and people have suggested suggested multiple things in the comments on how to improve the compound so thank you very much for that firstly we're going to go over to floor and paving put some paving into the bottom of this canteen and then another door which means it's easier for these uh, consumers to come along and then up into here it means we can obviously have the two other tables in there if we need to and i'll probably expand the canteen down here also in the bathroom i didn't realize but i've only got oh i don't actually have the money i've only got a three sinks as opposed to the four toilets so i need to make sure that we have an equal or greater amount of sinks so i'm going to change that as well uh, there's been a lot of suggestions when it comes to the bedrooms down the bottom and move things over to this bedroom that's a good idea but it's just going to be a lot of work and i think i have a bit of a solution so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven i want to go for one two three four five uh one two three four five this one this bedroom we are going to change it and i will unassign that room like so all of these items uh, i'll go to objects and then move objects I'm not a big fan of the way you have to move the objects but it is what it is and then that goes in there and then i'm just going to place that temporarily in there too and then this is going to become a it's most likely going to become a sort of very small toilet. It says bathroom, but it's basically going to be uh, like toilets and sinks just in and around here. That's probably what it's going to be, but I'll change that later on. And here, where we've got all of these separate bedrooms, which I would very much not recommend, we're going to do a bit of a hack, a bit of an overhaul. <laughs> and we're going to go to delete wall, and I'm going to delete the walls right across there. And I'm going to do the same thing on this side as well. Now, obviously, we've still got the separate doors. It looks a bit garbage if we're honest but i may change that up i may end up moving the doors and whatnot but the main takeaway is that we can go to rooms to the bedroom and then assign these as bedroom and you see the prestige it shoots right up because of the size so no longer have we got the downgraded uh downrated should i say bedroom so overall that is an improvement so good 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 we do want to get a couple more consumers currently on 11 of 13 and 9 followers and i've uh, been made aware of how we can check where our followers and their what their ratings are so to do with the overall recruit level so yeah look like that one is going to be a very good recruit james jefferson there so overall we are doing all right we are as you can see cooking some food up here so we can serve it in the canteen we've got kevin who is fixing things because apparently Apparently we had smoke coming out the salt and pepper pots. I don't know what's in that uh, sauce bottle in the middle, but apparently it's got a lot of smoky flavour to it. Maybe it's barbecue sauce. Who knows? And uh, yeah, we've got people now arriving and turning up. We also have some injured people, but I think that's just sort of not washed hands and we can fix that shortly. I do want to, as I said, go for some more, some more uh, sinks and most likely what I'll do this place another two sinks here another toilet there and another two sinks there so we've got more than enough uh, i think for that in terms of our progress for research it is all right we're currently working on if we scroll along the heat redu uh, reduction missions we don't really need that at the moment but it's nice to have and we also have some missions here so we've got things like object acquisition object acquisition and a pr campaign as well which i think we will do so we're going to set that going with someone who is good at pr so jessica carter is good at that and someone like um Someone like Chloe, perhaps? Yeah, that would work. You can see that would be 100%. So we're going to begin that mission and send them off. I was going to send uh, Alicia, but the problem is that she's working in the research lab and I really don't want to send her off to do other things. We need to um, research some evil. Anyway, oh, but actually evil? I don't know if evil is the uh, correct term here. Um, I mean, probably. Um, but yeah, it's 
probably more accurate descriptions of what we're doing here. Um, quackery being <laughs> one of them, I think. But there you are. You see, we've got our planning room here as well. Um, obviously, we haven't actually ran anything uh, in here. But we uh, do have the options now on the main menu for some high-rated stuff. But we'll check that out as we as we go on. I also want to at least tidy up something in the centre here. I mean, we've got a lot of objects that I just haven't placed. So, uh, we also got, like, these darkness-themed objects. Um... Yeah, I mean, there's like vials of blood and some of them, most of them aren't available, we've placed most of them. I can't place any of the infernal stuff because that's already maxed out, but uh, decor-wise, we've got things like a barrel. I mean, what <laughs> what does that do? Just increase the rating of something? Why would a barrel increase the rating of something? Where would one put a barrel? Um, I guess in here, that will increase the prestige, perhaps. I don't know if that's done that, but there you are, it's now in. We've got a leader statue as well, which I do want to place somewhere. We've got two on the outside, but um, maybe one on the inside and a nice fountain as well. That would be quite nice. I think you can get a fountain. Yeah, there's your leader statues there, but this has to go has to go inside. Um, maybe put the leader statue right behind here. Um, over there. There we go. That's, that's pretty good. Getting all those in is most likely... A good idea. Let's go to... Mm, actually, we're going to have to close that back open again. Uh, there's no water. What about fountain? Um, yeah, we do have fountain. There you go. So different fountains. So maybe make this like a nice little, nice little area for uh, people to hang around. It uh, may be a good idea. Over to our food here and just double checking the kitchen. We have the burgers on the go and we've got uh, no ingredients for that. So I do want to probably get some more. It's going to cost a grand. Let me perhaps not uh, buy that many. Sadly, <laughs> you can't hold shift and reduce that down. So we will just wait or click until... Uh, carpal tunnel. Maybe just just spend a little bit less later on. Uh, and as you can see, pre preparedness on the burgers and the meat and vegetables. I don't know if we can actually make the meat and vegetables. Can we? Can we not? No, we don't have them unlocked. That's a thing you have to research. You can see that they are using the the uh, sinks there, so that's fine. Those are now in. So improvements here, improvements there. This one has recently got a step ladder, so that's been improved. Uh, bedrooms are fine. We've got um, one, two, three, four, five, ten, um, ten. 12, 14, 16, 18 in total, so more than enough, I think, uh, for that. So just going to go through some of these people here and just check to see their ratings. I think this is what people mentioned. So you can see the maximum for that person is 476, whereas this one is 644. I think that's what was mentioned. So I do want, yeah, like James Jefferson there, maybe that's what we're looking for. And that person there, yeah, 294. So it takes longer to get someone. Let's let's try Rachel here, who's 532. And let's recruit that person. And let's see. There should be average rating, I hope. Let's see if any of that is actually true. And we have someone who is quality poor. Brilliant. Uh, <laughs> so I don't know if that is the way for Forward, I will. Uh, I'm just going to dismiss them, and obviously that's going to increase heat and stuff. But no big dramas there. Uh, let's speed up to max speed while we crack on. Uh, research is almost complete. Mission is complete, and it is a turn-in mission job done. We also have our object acquisitions here, so we can start a covert operation. So that will start to level up and make it easier, I think. Uh, we also want to check out our research, and that should now be complete. There we go. Heat reduction missions will periodically become available on the world map. Most good. We've got an infirmary, so having that on site is going to be very desirable however we do need it looks to be a room boost there we also have idle uh, idle silver so increase the faith of the temple of generic we also have a paint station which we don't have unlocked increasing the cleaning speed in the maintenance room yeah, it's not bad. Circular saw, same thing. Faith cap. I think an infirmary. I think go for mood boost and then go for infirmary. So we have heat reduction missions here. You now have access to heat reduction missions. You know I like to live life on the edge. Yes, a maverick. And sometimes things just get a little too spicy, even for me. We can go out into the community and complete missions to reduce heat and our organisation and try to calm the press. And more importantly, the cops. Yeah, fair enough, fair enough. We do have some level ups here, so we can see Claire is doing some recruiting. They are an average quality person, and I'm trying to see if they have any traits. It doesn't say 
that they have any skills to pay the bills there. But I'm going to check in consumers and go over to our jobs. This is Claire. And there's Claire. No, see, it's completely across the board. They're not... Uh, They've not got anything there. So what are we really missing out on? So we've got uh, nobody who's really intelligent. So we're going to increase intelligence like so. Also got a couple more levels up um, from... Let's have a quick look. From here. This is Christopher Ghost Whisperer. That's where they are at the moment. And Christopher is terrible at empathy. Hmm. One em I was going to say one empathizes. Uh... <laughs> Let's go ahead and maybe put, maybe again, go up intelligence. We've got at least a couple of characters that uh, have got that intelligence trait there. And Aria as well. Again, don't have many traits. I think we're going to get one person who, we've only got one that's really good at retail, uh, one that's really good at public speaking. So maybe public speaking is uh, the way to go. Obviously, a lot of these jobs are automatically assigned. Um, one, two, three, four of them I've set, but the rest of them are set automatically and we may get some we may get rid of some of the other followers i haven't uh, yet decided and good grief i've just realized we've got loads of money that is uh, nice so i'm going to put in another one of those i'm going to put in another maybe toilet in here maybe a couple more toilets uh one two more toilets followed by a sink so all of the consumers if they want can go there and use that in terms of the recreational room we have a couple of things in here. We've got a slot machine. We've got a couple of these things. I think another slot machine would be nice. And maybe another decor item. But I am absolutely out of it. Uh, can we not try anything else there? No. I wanted maybe another potted plant. So can we just go for indoors? Potted plant 300. I only have... 200 and oh actually it's gone up i was gonna say 200 but it's 91 but it's 296 now and yes there we go we can put another potted plant in here uh, or indoors potted plant and click and that hasn't increased the prestige at all i think we're on the max amount for that or something i do want to change up the i do want to change up these and change these to a storage locker because these cupboards are a bit different but what i'll do is put the lockers on this side so we have both and that should hopefully increase it but we shall see we are now running another another um what's it called sermon in here yeah sermon quality is three out of five standard sermon you can see it says altar required for this and i mean is there anything else i can get i've got lecterns got pews basics and all that sort of thing but yeah it's 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 all fine i guess and there it is that is our uh, consumers are feeling super duper and that is exactly what uh, middle managers use uh, in the technical terms and <laughs> That's what I thought would happen. They went through that door, through that door, through that door, because that is the most efficient way to get to where they sleep. So there you are. Another mission has been uh, has been ran. You can see, uh, sorry, has been has been assigned here. We've got a heat reduction mission which expires in 16 hours. So I would like to run that, but I'll probably run that in the daytime. Um, we're going to also look at object acquisition once the covert ops has been done. Have we got someone assigned to the covert ops room? I don't think we have. So over to jobs here to covert ops and it's someone who, well, what do you need for covert ops? Well, it'll almost certainly be espionage, yes. Uh, planning. So someone good at planning and espionage. Well, Eleanor. It's going to be Eleanor, isn't it? So she is assigned to the kitchen. I think we'll assign them to covert ops. Um, yeah, yeah. She's just really good because obviously the the quality is quality is average there. What else in butchery? Do we have anyone else in butchery? No, we do not. Do we have anyone else in for food prep? Where's food prep? So, kitchen, which is this one. So, Kevin. Kevin, Kevin, Kevin. Where are you at? Kevin, there. You are assigned to the maintenance room in the kitchen. I'm going to assign you to both, and they'll crack on to do that. So, we'll still be able to do all of that, which is fine. We still have more meals in here, I believe. We have... 
how many meals does it say that we have? We've got 31 gruel and 72 burgers, so more than enough for our needs. Back over to followers here, I'm just going to double check this. We can see James Jefferson is almost ready for recruiting. Let's just check this one out. So, uh, there we go, we can recruit them and they are deciding and they also have pretty much the same uniform anyway and they are now recruited. They are a poor quality. Okay, so I assume I am looking at the wrong thing then, which is a bit of a shame. Uh, yeah, I thought the I thought that was a rating of it. What if we go the other way? Something that's really low, like easy to recruit. Four hundred three two. There's a two. Let's recruit. And obviously we may have to get rid if they are really poor quality. Very poor. Okay. So, sorry about that. Dismiss. Dismiss. That's going to increase heat, but there you are. Oh, planning is underway. This is good. Some skills that have gone up. And they have good skills in espionage, so that's going to increase. Go for intelligence. And it says these are in need of level up, but I don't think they are. There you are. Okay, so let's just check our missions. Covert Ops is running. If I assign someone who's good at PR, chance 100%, begin the mission. Heat reduction. Can't assign people anyway. I don't know why you can't run more than one mission. It's a bit of a shame, but it is what it is. Um, we need to steal that darkness item. In terms of rooms, I don't know if there's anything we're short on. What consumer was injured? Dirty hands whilst eating. But we've got more than enough sinks. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, maybe, maybe that's not... The right thing then. Let's go for move object, that toilet. It's gonna move down to there, oh, we can't, okay. I'll just delete it then. Um, just delete that one and then put another sink in. There we are. Just so we've got more sinks than <laughs> what I think is uh, really required. Loads consumers going here, so maybe best to increase the size of this. Looks like they're using, they're playing backgammon, the no one on dominoes, but they really like these machines up here. And they'll be playing chess. You don't have to put any seating around it as well, which I think people did say you have to, but it doesn't look like you need to do that. But there we are. Back to rooms then, see if there's anything we are lacking. Bathroom, no. Bedrooms, no. Canteens, no. Cover, we've got one. Kitchen, one. Leader Sanctum, one of. Lobby, one of. Maintenance room, one of. Rec room, one. Recruitment, one. Research, one. Temple, one. And then therapy rooms, we've got one of everything. And then the Infernal Darkness Heat room, which is over there. So yeah, it's pretty much things are in. Um, We're going to... We're going to probably try to sort of brighten this place up a little bit. Um, not that that <laughs> is strictly necessary. But we're going to go to outdoors and see we've got billboard lights and flags. And yeah, we like the statues here. Um, I like the idea of like maybe like a sort of big compoundy statue thing. So is there a middle ground? I don't think there is. I don't know really what to place there. Oh, you place like rocks and such and soil. Little uplighters. Little lampposts as well. There's a lot to place. But you can see none of it increases prestige, so I don't really understand what the big deal would be. Um... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 12, 13. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, I'm going to do that. Delete that. And these little bits. 
gonna have fountains around here. And I wanted like a little sort of flower garden. Almost. No, you can have, yeah, them flowers. I'm just gonna have a nice little sort of flower garden around the centre. We're making so much money that it's, uh, it's pretty good. Let's complete mission. And we've got a skull candle. All right. Let's start covert ops for this object acquisition and put Eleanor on it. Oh, that would be 100% chance. Let's go and do that. Get it done. Good. Okay. Uh, so we've got darkness mission is running and we've got a spread darkness mission here and we have to add that to the map. I'll wait for that to be completed so we can get back to it later on. Heat's at 197 and slowly going down. Excuse me. Had a half hiccup in the middle of that sentence. Uh, slowly going down. Mm. Just checking out some of these recruits here. Potential recruits. Consumers are feeling finally like everything's coming up cult. There you go. Mood range is good. Excellent. I don't know whether we want to increase the size of this as well. It was going to be extended one up and two to the left. That was the plan. That was the goal. But we'll see. There's the flowers I put in. I'm going to disperse them with different coloured ones. So complete the turn in. Golden statue on scales. Alright. And we'll probably do a heat reduction. Sign them to it. 70% chance to run that one. Yeah. Let's begin. We'll try it. We'll try it. So, spread darkness mission. Increase darkness rating and theme rating. Mm. We'll add the mission to that. Okay. Got another level up here. Um, Eleanor. We can put her on planning. So if you've got 18 espionage and 6 on planning. So brilliant at that sort of thing. Which is good. Food. We can see is on 80. So we've got 80 prepared food. There's research complete, and that should be leader ability allow the leader to boost skills of anyone entering the room at the cost of influence. And we're going to go for the infirmary. We'll research that. So a room boost. You can now perform a room boost. I can use my dashing good looks, exceptional sense of humour, and incredible singing voice to lift the mood of anyone who walks into the room. Hmm. Just remember that I'm the head dispenser, not some game show horse, so it'll cost us an influence. I don't want anyone getting the idea that I'm their friend. Fair enough. So, room boost. Room buff. Yeah. So I can say, I have to select a particular room. I think I have to go over there. Yeah, so... There you go. So every time they come in, yeah, their their mood's going up. <laughs> That's really good. And this is a good place to set it going as well. So we've got we've always had the the mood buff, so praise consumer. So that's pretty good that we've got the the buff there. All their moods going up. I'm not using the skill one, but there you are. Uh, mission turn in is is complete but it has increased heat so oh sorry no it is heat rating decrease by 34 that's brilliant that's what we're looking for that's what we're looking for good I'm gonna go over to food here and order and I'm gonna order probably thousand 
before that. Um, back over to here, we've got some level ups. A recruiter here, over public speaking. We should give them the skills that we think are required. Say this one. No. When the max out, it uh, tells you you've got a boost one. I actually haven't. Over to objects and to outdoors. And these flowers. Like that. And I'm just putting them in like a layered pattern. And you can see the money we're getting is really good, so don't need much more than that. I think another table is worth it. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16. Oh no, we've only got, we've got, yeah, we don't, we don't need that many more. Okay, that's fine. For this person, currently on the Spin Master, <laughs> um, hit slot machines, disorganised and rotten. I mean, put them in butchery, I guess. <laughs> it sounds like really dodgy that we're doing that. Um, consumers, then. Anyone that's very poor, I'm very tempted to get rid of. Hmm. Yeah. Possibly. Thing is, I'm looking. Oh, they've been here since the start of the game, and in this sort of thing. But we are. The whole point is that we're exploitative. It's just hard to sort of shake that. Um, there's that side done. I'm sure I'm going to make some mistakes when placing these. But oh, I need one more just there. How much more do we need? We need oh, that amount of money. There you go. And then the other ones we're going to put as uh, white flowers. These ones um, here. But not yet, because I'm saving up for something shortly. Let's assign a consumer over here, and there's no one that's really good at it. Oh no, there's someone that's really good at it. Amy, there you go. 100% chance to increase theme rating and get experience. So we'll do just that. And I'm tempted to recruit some more people, but obviously they're not currently here. Oh. Here's another sermon, but praise be the worshippers beverage. Yeah, sadly, some of these are broken. It doesn't seem to be too much of a problem, though. Consumers are feeling rather happy about themselves. There we are. Okay, good, 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 good. We are halfway to getting the infirmary. Mission is almost complete in both of these you can see this is both running and we do have a heat reduction mission which i probably want to run sooner rather than later just to get that heat down under the sort of 150 mark would be ideal because i do want to cycle through some of the there's a theme rating increase nice um yeah i do want to cycle through some of our some of our consumers i think that would be worthy i think over here then we've got another darkness acquisition mission which we will assign to that. It does cost influence and faith to unlock but it's no drama at all. Okay I think we're going to leave it there for now. That's been a bit of Honey I Joined a Cult. In the next episode we're going to build an infirmary. Most likely I'll extend it up to here and then this is going to be our infirmary. I don't know how big it actually is. Uh, is required really for the for the infirmary but i would imagine that that's not too bad and oh we have we have a problem we have a, a mood break so yeah i think that's one of the first that we've seen oh and they've stopped i think it's they've just yeah the mood was really low but then they needed to get some of these done and Straight away, they've got them sorted now. Okay, job done. They just had a couple of needs that uh, needed sorting. Right, we're going to leave there for now. That's been a bit of Honey, I Joined a Cult. We have placed some fountains and <laughs> some nice flowers and obviously done some upgrades around here, done some missions. It's just generally progressed on and hopefully things are much improved. In terms of research, which is where we're really looking at, I mean, we are quite 
sort of on the way through here on the research. Actually about halfway there and you've got different upgrade caps and auto experimenter. Ooh, can it's discovery speed and additional 30% chance. Okay. Um we've got stuff to research. Discombobulation therapy upgrade. A lot of these are just upgrades, you see, they're not ancient armor. Ooh. Yeah. There's some stuff that we can unlock and build, but most of it seems to be just upgrades. And monolith room is good as well. I really like more research, but we tried to do more research and it just didn't work out. You just you can't have that. But there you are. Either way, we're going to leave it there for now. That's been a bit of fun. Yeah, I joined a cult. In the next episode, we will look at building the, building the infirmary. I think that would be probably the way to go. Either way, I hope you have enjoyed the episode and the series as far. Comments in the comments. Thanks very much for watching. Take care and generic partings. <laughs>